Step one, wake up early, gon' rise with the sun. Step two, get some good, some food in you. Step three, think real hard about what you wanna be. Step four, fuck everybody, just do your thing. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. 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 Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be. Hello, everyone. Welcome to my channel. So today we are going to make very, very cute little uh, rabbit, as you can see. So you can use it as a keychain, as a pendant, or a decor. Okay. So I have listed the materials at the beginning of the video so go back and check out the materials that you need and let's get started. Okay so we're going to start with the head and the body and we're going to start by doing the magic ring and then we'll do six single crochets into the magic ring. So one, two, three, four five and six okay and then I'll pull my yarn to close the gap and I'll place my marker over here so now in the second round we are going to increase each stitch around so we're going to have 12 stitches so we'll increase so increasing will mean uh, two single crochets in each stitch. Okay, so we'll increase the first stitch. Increase the next stitch. Increase the third stitch. And increase in all the remaining three stitches. Okay, so now in the third round. We are going to do single crochet then increase in the next stitch and we are going to repeat that all the way around so we'll have a total of 18 stitches so we'll do single crochet then increase in the next stitch and we'll repeat single crochet increase And we'll keep repeating that all the way round. Okay, so now in the fourth round, we're going to do two single crochet, then increase in the next, and then two single crochet, increase, and we'll repeat that all the way round. So we'll do single crochet, one, and then single crochet in the next stitch, and increase. And we'll repeat that so single crochet then single crochet in the next stitch and increase okay and we'll keep repeating that all the way round okay so now after we are done with that now for the next six rounds which is from round five until round ten we are going to do single crochets all the way around in each row for a total of 24 stitches in each round. Okay, so we are going to continue by doing single crochet in every stitch. Okay, so continue doing single crochets all the way in this round. And the next 
six rounds until you get to round 10 okay so i'll see you when you're done with the 10th round and then we'll start with the 11th round together okay so after we're done with the 10th round this is how our little rabbit looks like so now in the 11th round we are going to do two single crochets then decrease and we'll repeat that all the way round for a total of 12 stitches okay so we'll do single crochet one then single crochet two and then we are going to decrease and then we'll repeat that so two single crochets and decrease and we'll keep repeating that all the way round okay so after we're done with that now in the 12th round we're going to do single crochets all the way around for a total of 18 stitches so we'll continue and do single crochets and continue doing single crochets all the way round okay so now in the 13th round we are going to do single crochets then decrease then do single crochet decrease and we are going to repeat that all the way round okay so we're going to do single crochet and then decrease and repeat so single crochet and decrease and we're going to keep repeating that all the way round okay so guys remember we are making the body and the head together so at the end of the 13th round start stuffing because we are uh, finishing with the body and then going to the head okay so now in the 14th round we are going to start by doing three decreases okay so we're going to decrease three times so decrease decrease one and then decrease again and decrease the third time okay and then we'll do um, single crochet in the remaining six stitches so we'll do single crochet one two until the end so we have a total of nine stitches in that round okay so now in the uh, 15th round we are going to increase that by increasing three times so we'll increase in the first stitch then increase in the next stitch and increase again and then we'll do a single crochet in the remaining six stitches so one two three four five and six okay so now we have a total of 12 stitches okay 
so now in the 16th round we are going to do single crochet then increase and we'll repeat that all the way round for a total of <coughs> sorry for a total of 18 stitches so we'll do single crochet then increase in the next stitch then again we'll do single crochet and increase and we'll repeat that all the way round okay so now after we are done with that now for the next three rounds which is from round 17 to round 19 we are going to do single crochets all the way around in each row for a total of 18 stitches in each round okay so you're going to continue and do single crochet all the way and continue until you get to the 19th round and then we'll start the 20th round together okay so after we're done with the 19th round this is how our little rabbit looks like so now in our 20th round we are going to do single crochet then decrease and we we'll repeat that all the way around for a total of 12 stitches okay so we'll do single crochet and then decrease and then we'll repeat single crochet and then decrease and we'll keep repeating that all the way round okay so after you're done stuff the head fully because the next round is our last round and in the next round we are going to decrease all the way around six times so we'll have six stitches okay so we're going to decrease and decrease again and we're going to keep decreasing all the way to the end Okay, and the last time okay and then when we get to the end I'm going to remove my marker and then I'll slip stitch in the stitch where I just removed my marker and I'll cut the yarn Then I'm going to finish up Then I'll cut the yarn like that. Okay, so that's our head and our body. So now we are going to start making the ears. So the ears are quite easy. We are going to start by making six single crochets into the magic ring. So one, two, three. 
two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, and then I'll pull the end, close the gap, and place my marker over here. So now in the second round, we are going to uh, do two single crochet, then increase, and we'll do that two times for a total of eight stitches. So we'll do single crochet, one, single crochet, two, and then increase in the next stitch. And then we'll repeat that again. So single crochet, one, single crochet, two, and increase in the last stitch. Okay, so now after that, for the next three rounds, which is from round three until round five, we are going to do single crochets in each round for a total of eight stitches. Okay, so we are going to continue and do single crochets. And do single crochets until the end of the fifth round. And then we'll start the sixth round together. Okay, so after we're done with the fifth round, this is how it looks like. So now in the sixth round, we are going to do uh, two single crochets, then decrease and we'll do that two times. Okay, so we'll do single crochet one and single crochet two and then decrease. And then we'll repeat that one time. So single crochet one and then single crochet two and then decrease. Okay, so now we have a total of uh, six stitches. So now in the last round, we are going to do single crochets all the way round. So we'll have a total of six single crochets. So single crochets all the way to the end. Okay, so when we get to the end, I'm going to remove my marker and then I'll slip stitch. And then I'll cut a yarn long enough for sewing. Okay, so you're going to make the other ear the exact same way and then we'll make the legs. Now for the legs, we are going to make four and one tail. So all of them we are making with the same pattern, okay, which is quite simple. So we'll start by doing six single crochets in the magic ring. So one, two, three, four, five, and six okay then i'll place my marker so now for the next two rounds which is round two and round three we are going to do single crochets all the way around in each round for a total of six stitches in each round okay 
so we are going to have something like that looks like this okay so do single crochets in the next two rounds and then we'll finish up together okay so when we're done with the third round this is our little leg so to finish up we are just going to slip stitch in the next stitch and cut off the yarn long enough for sewing like that so you're going to make the other four leg uh, the other three legs the exact same way and the tail too so for my tail i used white color like this it will look the same way as the legs okay so now let's join all the parts together okay so guys as you can see i've just finished putting the parts together so what i did is first i started with the ears you know the big part is the body and the small part is the head okay so from here i counted one one two three and in the third round from the head is where you attach the uh the ear over here looking like that slanting uh towards the body and then you count one two three three stitches apart you attach the other parts of the ear as you can see and then for the legs i came here i counted one two three right here where you joined uh the head and the body you count one two three and in the third row from the head is where you attach the first leg and then uh you count one two three three stitches apart you attach the other leg like that okay and then you come here starting uh from the last part of the body you count one two three four and in the fourth round or around the fifth round between the fourth and the fifth round is where you attach the back leg and then you count one two three four uh four rounds apart you attach the other leg okay and then the tail i just attached it here at the very top as you can see like that and then i embroidered the little eyes right below the ear and then also the other eye as you can see that's how it looks like so if you have dull eyes you can attach them and then uh i embroidered the little mouth using a, a dark pink yarn okay so this is how it looks generally so guys i hope you enjoyed this pattern if you have any question you can ask in the comment box below and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe and check out my other videos until next time bye